Here we are at Quartzsite, Arizona with another happy campfire in a can customer. Now, you have one of our older campfire in a cans. Uh, yeah, I have one of the original small ones okay. that you had uh, in 2006. Okay. So. You must like it because you remember when you bought it. I, I love it, actually. You know, this year has not been as cold, but the previous two years, like last year, was freezing cold. So I really learned to love my campfire in a can because here, out here in Quartzsite, I can pretty much put it together, put a log in it, and it's good to go. And then when I'm done, close it back up and I'm finished. So, I mean, it can go pretty much anywhere with me. Great. So. Now, what would you say to the people out there that would come online and they'd look at this product and they'd say, wow, it's a little bit controversial, the way that it looks, the way, etc." What would you tell them about it? That it's actually probably one of the most ingenious things I've seen because of the ability to carry it with you anywhere. It's compact, it's easy. You put some wood in it or a sterno log you know, and you light it up, you have a fireplace basically anywhere you want to go without having to find fire pits at campgrounds and stuff like that. And since we RV all over the country, I can pretty much set it right outside my front RV door. Boom, set some chairs around it, grab some beer, we're good to go. And I never have to worry about it. When I'm done, you close it back up, put it back away. Would it be fair to say that you love your campfire in a can? I love my campfire in a can. Yes, I do. <laughs> I most certainly do. Thanks.